Hey, this is Steve with Real-Time Music Solutions, and today we're going to look at how to use external software synths with RMS keyboards in Windows. So, first off, you're going to need to download the free virtual MIDI port called Loop B1. And uh, there should be a link to this in the FAQ that led you to this video. Here we are on the page. At the bottom it says download your free copy for personal use. You can download set up loop b1.exe and you'll install it just like any other piece of software. After it's installed you'll open it up. If you don't have a shortcut on your desktop it actually goes to here nerds.de it's in there. Um, after you've got it open, uh, you might not immediately see it because it's actually hiding down here in your task manager. It looks like loop B1 internal MIDI port is active. Okay, and now we'll want to open up the uh, soft synth that you're using. Uh, we've got contact 5 here. We're going to go to File Options. We're going to set the loop B internal MIDI to port A. See, I've already got it that way. I'm in the MIDI preferences here. Click close. And now I'm going to drop in my instrument. So I've got this organ here. It's in place. I've got RMS keyboards open. I'm gonna click to switch to edit mode. I'm gonna replace the piano here. And so you know, if, you, if I wanted to replace all of the pianos in the show, before I make this edit, I could just click here for global edits. Right now, we'll just replace this one. Um, I'm going to click external. For device, I'm going to set it to loop B internal MIDI. And click OK. And now when I play... I'm going to be hearing this instrument that I selected in contact instead of the piano in our sampler. And it's really that easy. And you're gonna hit File, Save, and that's it. Um, like I said, if I wanted to do this globally, all I would have to do is click this, continue, Set it up, click OK, it's there. Now we have this pop piano here. Here's the pop piano again. And as we can see, it is set. External, loopy, MIDI, etc. And uh, you can select the channel here. This is um, if you're in contact and you've got multiple instruments, then you'd have to route them specifically uh, per, uh, per MIDI channel here. But that's the uh, quick and easy way to get this working in RMS keyboards. Take care.